welcome to Ujuni. Uh, just kidding. This is um, a lake near Toledo. I've uh, actually been here already twice, uh, in, in, I think three years ago. I'm here today to shoot the Milky Way, which is going to rise that way. We got a little bit of water, so you're going to get some reflection tonight. I have to go a little bit in the middle of the of the lake because uh, the the water is only it's just concentrating concentrate in one spot. It hasn't been raining for a while here, so basically this is just the the water that comes from the from the river down there and it stays here. So, but it's good. We got a nice um, a nice reflection here. So I'm going to shoot at night. I uh, will start uh, 1 a.m. Something like that before the Milky Way rises, which was, which, which I think is rising uh, uh, past one or, or something like that. So I need to remember where <laughs> where to go because it's quite difficult here to understand where you are because uh, you know you're in the middle of the water. Oh yeah, I, I got already a spot, so I'm gonna I'm gonna stick with that spot. So yeah, let's see how it goes. is doing some panorama, Javier is sleeping at the moment at the car and uh, we'll wake up uh, half past four so I'm gonna have to do something at the end with the Milky Way a little bit more vertical. I'm waiting until 5.45 and so basically when the lights of the day is starting to appear I will go at the camera and maybe ramping uh, the exposure and go through the sunrise. I don't know, maybe, we'll see. <laughs> and that's it. Uh, maybe do another shot for the sunrise? I don't know, maybe. But I'm going to do a little, a little siesta now. Uh, we got a couple hours to kill. So I'm going to sleep a little bit. And uh, Milky Way is already out. Nice. There is a little bit of light pollution, but uh, it's okay. Kind of like it. Uh, okay, see you in a bit. at the sunrise nice mm, we had a really good night wasn't too cold likely so yeah the reflection as well was was pretty cool as um, the water actually risen during the night i don't know why maybe the river got more water it got actually more more reflections that's good so hopefully on the on the on the time lapse at the end you'll see a cool milky way reflection on the on the lake on the laguna Something I did with this uh, Milky Way shoot uh, is uh, to use uh, the ISO invariance. So I set the ISO at 800 and basically I uh, will not lose uh, all the highlights uh, of the light pollution. So I can adjust a little bit more the highlights and I have a little bit more colors. So let's see how it goes. So yeah, that's it. Uh, I'm going to pack it up and drive home. And uh, of course, uh, subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you in the next one. Ciao, ciao.